Good morning, Broncos. This is Bria Campbell with your Bronco News Team bringing you all the news and information that's central to our school. Today is Thursday, April 4th, 2024. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may now be seated. And now for today's Bronco Bit. Did you know that 60 years ago today, the Beatles broke all American chart records when the Billboard charts on April 4th showed them with the top five records in the country? And that record still holds true today. Thank you, Valerie. Let's take a look at what's trending in campus life. Join First Priority. They meet every Monday in room 6110 from 3 to 4 p.m. Join the Muslim Student Association, a club dedicated to Muslims on campus. Anyone is welcome, and it will take place every other Wednesday from 3 to 4 p.m. in room 4108 after school. For updates, join the Google Classroom with the code ZEQQ3QG. The Media Center is hosting its March Madness tournament, so get out those phones and vote, Broncos. Here's today's QR code. Today's vote will determine who will face the hate you give in tomorrow's championship. Will it be Diary of a Wimpy Kid or Fahrenheit 451? Scan the QR code to vote for your favorite book to advance to tomorrow's championship round. May the best book win. Join Team Best Buddies for this year's Friendship Walk on April 20th. Let's break barriers and create a society where everyone thrives. Make a difference today and be a part of this incredible journey towards a more inclusive future. Use the QR code on the screen to join. Get ready to head into the swamp as the Bronco players celebrate their 20th season by performing Shrek the Musical today through the 6th. Student night is tonight. Tickets can be purchased at pbc.booktix.com or by scanning the QR code on your screen. We hope to see you there. Thank you, Valerie. Now for a class council update. Attention all students who have submitted prom contracts. You are now able to purchase your tickets. Ticket sales will continue throughout the week. Sales will happen during lunch in the auditorium. Tickets cost $115. Cash or check is preferred, but if you need to pay with a card, please bring the card or card information when you come to purchase. Some of you had errors in your contract or still had obligations that needed to be cleared. When you approach the table and scan your ID, if it comes up that you were not cleared, you will not be able to purchase your ticket. You will only be able to once you have cleared your obligations. If you have an approved guest, you can also purchase their ticket. If you have any questions, please contact Ms. Bestman. And here's Bria with an academic update. Thank you, Kalia. Tutoring opportunities are now available. NHS offers tutoring every Monday in Portable 16. Please see your teacher for a pass. Are you ready for the Algebra 1 EOC? Join the Math Honor Society during lunch in room 7109 on Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Remember to bring your EOC review packet with you. We hope to see you there. Row Cap has tutoring opportunities during both lunches to study for the U.S. History EOC in room 4110. See your U.S. History teacher for a pass and bring your Chromebook. National Honor Society offers peer tutoring for every subject on Wednesdays at 3 p.m. Join the Google Meet with the code PBCNHS. This week in Bronco Nation Sports. Last night, the girls' flag football team won against Boca High 12-0. Boys' baseball lost 2-5 against the Blue School. Beach volleyball lost to the Blue School 0-5. The boys' lacrosse team lost 4-10, and the girls' lacrosse lost 6-14. The girls' water polo team fought a tough match against the Sharks of Spanish River and came home with the second place in the district. Congratulations, ladies. Today, beach volleyball heads to King's Academy for its match at 5. Boys' volleyball plays American Heritage at 7, and baseball heads to West Boca for a game at 6.30. Remember, Broncos, tickets for all sporting events must be purchased ahead of time at GoFan.co. Tune in tomorrow for more sports, scores, and highlights from your Bronco news team. We hope to see you there tonight and every night supporting your Bronco Nation. Yo, ever? Hey Central, I have a question for you. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Let's find out. What are the names of Shrek and Fiona's children? DM us the answer at PBC Bronco News on Instagram and the answer will be posted there later today. And now for today's weather. The rainy weather in West Palm Beach is clearing up. This afternoon will be much nicer with lower humidity and highs in the upper 70s to low 80s. Expect sunshine to peek through the clouds by the end of the day. Bundle up tonight, though. Temperatures will drop into the 50s, with some areas even reaching the lower 50s. Good news for the weekend? It's looking like a perfect mix of cool mornings and comfortable afternoons with plenty of sunshine. That's it for your Weather Central. Take it away, Valerie. Thank you, Bria. 
This has been your Bronco News team with Bria Campbell, Kalia Critchfield, and me, Valerie Chandler, bringing you all the news and information that is central to our school. For additional updates and info, follow the Bronco News team on Instagram at PBC Bronco News. Broncos, please remember to display positivity, show respect and integrity, exemplify dedication and excellence today and every day. Have a theatrical Thursday, Broncos.